Advanced Sudoku Strategy, Swordfish Explained. We have a swordfish when a candidate appears at the intersections of three rows and three columns following certain rules. In this example, taken from a partially solved expert Sudoku, the candidate under consideration is two, and the intersections are highlighted in yellow while the columns and rows are highlighted in green and lavender, respectively. The candidate under consideration is called fish candidate. For green columns, the fish candidate needs to appear in at least two of the three yellow cells, but nowhere else outside the yellow cells. For lavender rows, the fish candidate needs to appear only in one or more of the three yellow cells, but it must also appear elsewhere outside the yellow cells. The rule of the strategy states that the fish candidate in the lavender rows, not in the yellow cells, can be eliminated, paving the way for moving forward. The solution of the fish candidate for each green column must be in one of the three lavender rows. Regardless of the rows the solutions are in, they must spread over three rows to avoid seeing in each other. Consequently, no fish candidates can be in the lavender rows other than those in the yellow cells. In this example, the fish candidate is an 8, which appears in 8 of the 9 intersections of 3 green rows and 3 lavender columns. Elimination of 3 8s in the lavender columns paves the way for moving forward. This example is called swordfish in the rows, and the previous example is called swordfish in the columns. Thank you for watching.